Toy Derricotte grew up outside Detroit. With the poet Cornelius Eady, she co-founded Cave Canem, an organization committed to cultivating and supporting the work of African-American poets. She says, truth-telling in my art is also a way to separate myself from what I have been taught to believe about myself, the degrading stereotypes about black women. Black Bottom. When relatives came from out of town, we would drive down to Black Bottom, drive slowly down the congested main streets, Bobian and Hastings, trapped in the mesh of Saturday night. We were freshly escaped, black middle class. We snickered and were proud. The louder the streets, the prouder. We laughed at the bright clothes of a prostitute, a man sitting on a curb with a bottle in his hand. We smelled barbecue cooking in dented wash tubs, and our mouths watered. As much as we wanted it, we couldn't take the chance. Rhythm and blues came from the windows, the throaty voice of a woman lost in the bass, in the drums, in the dirty down and out, the grind. I love to see a funeral, then I know it ain't mine. We rolled our windows down so that the waves rolled over us like blood. We hoped to pass invisibly, knowing on Monday we would return safely to our jobs, the post office and classroom. We wanted our sufferings to be offered up as tender meat and our triumphs to be belted out in raucous song. We had lost our voice in the suburbs, in Conant Gardens, where each brick house delineated a fence of silence. We had lost the right to sing in the street and damn creation. We returned to wash our hands of them, to smell them, whose very existence tore us down to the human. Thanks so much.